Welcome, Grapple fans, to the Saturday lunchtime treat you've waited for all week. Yes, it's the very best in professional wrestling. Coming up later, a great top of the bill contest. But they're already in fighting mood down there, so let's get right alongside our man at the ringside as we join Ken Walton. Thank you very much. Yes, Clive Myers and Steve Gray meet again later. But first, we welcome you to this all-star promotion here at Bedworth City Hall with a welterweight contest. In the ring, waiting for Jimmy Brakes. That's Jimmy Brakes from Bradford. Just 11 and a half stone now. He's gone up a bit in weight since his lightweight days. And here he comes into the ring to meet his opponent, young Peter Bainbridge, waiting for him in the opposite corner from Cheltenham. Lee Bamber is the MC. Let's see if he can get time to, in the, like the music and everything, to introduce these two contestants. Thank you, Gents. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and good afternoon to you at home. Welcome again to another afternoon of All-Star Wrestling. Our first contest this lunchtime is a special lightweight challenge match to be wrestled over six five-minute rounds, and yes, two falls, two submissions, or the one knockout will decide the winner. Where did you get that win? <laughs> Introducing to you, firstly, from the red corner on my left, a young man who, at only 16 years of age, is already tipped for top honours. I ask you to welcome Peter Bainbridge. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, from the blue corner, you can see the European lightweight championship belt. And of course, that belongs to Jimmy Brakes. Well, ladies and gentlemen, your referee for this contest from Bristol, Mr. Roger Brown. Roger Brown. Well, thank you, MC Lee Bamba. Jim Brakes from Bradford, of course. There he is, already arguing with the ref. As is his wont, Peter Bainbridge from Cheltenham, the young lad who started in the wrestling business at 16 years old. Seconds away, first round. Here we go for round one of a six five minute round contest. Two falls, two submissions, or a knockout to decide the vault. And already Junior Brakes going in for the attacking side headlock. Peter Bainbridge was born in December 1971 and his first bout was at 1987 at 16. So he's just still only 17 years old now. And that's a special, a great special being operated on him by this youngster. <laughs> the first time they've ever met. Briggs isn't going to like that. Brakes, of course, European lightweight champion. But he's been in the world of weight bracket for quite some time now. He's up to 11 stone 7. If he had to defend his lightweight belt, he'd have to train down by 7 pounds. He could probably do it too. The 17 year old youngster has the nerve to come in round one and deliver a Brit Jimmy Brakes special on him. This tight crowd here at the Bedworth City Hall. I love this one. And, and this one's only the start because the one they're really waiting for is Clive Iron Fist Myers versus Steve Gray, which comes after this. But we're going to enjoy this preliminary contest here this afternoon, no question. Do you not give public warnings? Always beefing. He's got it. Ladies and gentlemen, the referee gives a first public warning to Jimmy Brakes. <laughs> <laughs> Went slightly the wrong way. Jimmy Brakes asking for a public warning for Bainbridge. I don't know what for, but he was trying it. Oh. 
Come on! Well, we haven't seen breaks on the television screen for some time, but it hasn't changed much. It's still the same style. <laughs> Rolled out of that one really neatly. And Vakes rolls out of it neatly too. But the first time only. Jimmy <laughs> 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 Brace is always worried about his nose. I don't know why, it hasn't got a bone in it for years. Oh, no! I'm losing! I'm losing! I'm See, not really a stranglehold, not a headlock. Shoot your swampy mouth! Jimmy Brakes is a part-time wrestler these days. He's pretty, pretty busy running his own public house, the seconds out in Batley. So we don't see him so much on the screen these days. Oh, yes. Near arm lever, side headlock. Breaks in charge, and he's got about 25 seconds left in this first round to make something of this. Fifteen seconds. Five seconds. He's left it too late, whatever he's going to do. So, this young lad, Peter Bainbridge from Cheltenham, 17 years old, 11 stone 11 in weight, turned pro October 1986. Second away, round three. Round three, four to go, still no score. One public warning against Brakes, Brakes the one in the horizontal stripe, trunks. Roger Brown from Bristol, the referee. Then the shoulder wrench. Bainbridge learnt oh. one heck of a lot about this business since we first saw it on television a year ago. Lever breaks nicely up. Bainbridge over the top, Ooh, loosely, but he got it. Full Nelson breaks. Full Nelson almost for Bainbridge. Putting up holding press, and Bainbridge a chance here. And a first ball to Bainbridge in just one minute 22 seconds of round three. Well, that was pretty quick. Quite neat too. And this is how it happened. Brakes goes for the full Nelson. Bainbridge looks as though he's retaliating on that, but instead pushes him for the ropes. Brakes falls back. Bainbridge steps aside, waits for him to fold, and he holds the press. <laughs> round four, three to go. Seconds away, round four.
<laughs> that was Lee Bamba, the MC, that did that. <laughs> and it's the same move again. That's how the Bainbridge got the first fall. That's your submission. Immediate submission by Bainbridge. Just breaks does his special lift. Just 42 seconds, and Breaks gets the equalizing submission in round four. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we haven't seen it on television for some while, but there it is, the Jimmy Breaks special. It's the equalizer to Jimmy Breaks. Well, what a special move that is, especially the lift from it. But everybody happy about it except Bainbridge in his left arm. Seconds away, round five. Two rounds to go as we start round five. The score, one each. One fall to Bainbridge in the third, equalized by Brakes' submission in the fourth. One public warning against Brakes, two rounds to go. Bainbridge trying to keep the left arm out of the way. Doesn't want another of those break specials. Breaks thinking of nothing else as he goes for it. Avoiding it so far, but. Breaks will get in by some trick in a minute. There it is. And here's the special and the lift from it. Yes, in the submission, there's the winning submission to Breaks in just exactly one minute of round five. Breaks the winner, two submissions to Bainbridge's one fall. So, ladies and gentlemen, in exactly one minute of the round, two to one, the winner, of course, of the match is Jimmy Briggs. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, how about one for a very sporting loser? We're going to see a lot. Listen, never mind, sport. You, you're a young lad. You've got to learn every trick of the trade. So, coming next, the match that could turn out to be a real humdinger. Once again, Steve Gray.